Good evening, I'm Pat Harvey, and we begin tonight with three teenage lives cut short in a deadly police chase that ended in a head-on crash. The driver and two officers were also seriously hurt. KCAL's Nicole Comstock is live in Fontana tonight with those details. Nicole? You know, Pat, these kids were just so young. They were 14 and 15 years old. So even though police have identified them, we're not going to show you their photos until we hear back from their families tonight. Now, we did learn this evening as well that it was a 16-year-old driver behind the wheel, police say, who led them on this short but deadly pursuit. Tonight, a woman is relighting candles at a memorial on this sidewalk in Fontana because what happened here late Sunday night broke her heart. A violent high-speed crash that left three young high school students dead. The San Bernardino County Sheriff's Department has identified them as 15-year-old Robert Rias, 15-year-old Omari Pitts, and 14-year-old Dominic Adams Jr. They were all popular students at Carter High School in Rialto. I've been knowing Omari since middle school, but I met uh, Robert in Dominic this year. Jason and his brother Jacob were friends with all three of those young men. They shared this photo with us of a memorial for Omari in his classroom. They say they were just hanging out together on Friday. They were all just funny all the time, just goofy. They would always have a smile on their face, and then just to see that happen was crazy. What happened here is tragic. The Sheriff's Department says Fontana police officers attempted to pull over this white Nissan Sentra for an unidentified vehicle code violation. They say the driver, a 16-year-old boy, sped off, traveling at over 100 miles per hour during a pursuit that only lasted about 20 seconds. It ended, police say, when the driver lost control near Valley in Cyprus and hit a responding police car head-on. Two officers are now recovering from serious injuries, but the three passengers in the Sentra, Rias, Pitts, and Adams Jr., all died. The Rialto Unified School District sent us a statement that reads, the district is heartbroken in the loss of our three young students. Social emotional support for students and staff will continue at Carter High School and schools where students and staff have been impacted. The district also wishes the three surviving individuals a full recovery. This will be a challenging week for our education community, but we will remain resilient. People are going to the council. The San Bernardino County Sheriff's Department is now investigating the pursuit. They have not identified the 16-year-old driver or revealed why they believe he didn't just stop. Well, the 16-year-old driver was also taken to a hospital with serious injuries, and we are told he is in grave condition. It's unclear if he had a provisional driver's license or not, but generally speaking in California, 16-year-olds have to be supervised by someone 25 or older if they plan on driving with any other minors in the car. Reporting live in Fontana, I'm Nicole Comstock, KCAL News. Nicole, thank you.